Hi everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you how to upgrade your laptop's M.2 SSD without reinstalling Windows. Basically, we will clone the whole drive with all your apps, games and data onto the new M.2 drive. The whole process will take about 25 minutes, so let's get started. First, you'll need to buy a USB to M.2 adapter or enclosure. The cool thing about this device is that you can put your old M.2 SSD into this enclosure and make an awesome portable external USB storage. This adapter costs 10 to 20 bucks, depends on the model. The links in the description box below. There are two models of this enclosure, one for M.2 SATA or NGFF SSDs with B key or B plus M just like in my case, and the second one for M.2 PCI Express or NVMe SSDs with M key notch only. So just buy the correct one. Next we need to open the enclosure. It comes with this little screwdriver, so you don't need any tools. Slide the drive firmly into the slot at an angle, press it down and then tighten the screw. Ok, before we go any further we have to download and install Partition Wizard application. It's a very simple and free application which has a lot of useful features. The installation process is pretty typical, simply repeat after me. Next, plug the adapter into USB port and run Partition Wizard. Click Disk Clone and click Next. Now select the drive which you want to copy. Here is my old SSD and all its partitions. Click Next and select your target disk. Next, choose one of these options. For example, if you want Partition Wizard to automatically resize partitions, then select this first option. But in our case, I'd recommend to clone the drive as it is, without resizing, and then you can manually resize partitions the way you want it. Click Finish. Alright, so now click Apply and click Yes. We can't copy the drive with running operating system, so click Restart now. It will take about 20 minutes, depends on your drives and USB speed. Ok, now shut down your laptop and simply replace your SSD drive. Finally, put your old SSD into M.2 enclosure, tighten the screws and we got super fast and reliable external USB drive. And as you can see it's way faster than a regular USB 3.0 flash drive. Also, don't forget to remove all partitions from your external drive and then create one new partition. After everything is set to your liking, click the apply button to begin the process.